This is how to add music tracks to GarageBand on the iPad. Click on the icon for GarageBand and then what I do, you can use any one of these but I use audio, audio recorder then press the little plus sign at the top right hand corner which gives you how many bars and then you set it click that bit there and it go on, click that bit there and it goes gives you the you can either set eight nine ten or whatever but I set it to automatic so you have to set it to automatic and then you press that bit there which gives you the kind of timeline and then you click that circle bit there which I don't know what that's called and then you can import all your music Let's try that one. No, I don't want that one. Let's go back. Let's try to get that one. Right, let's try some song from there. Right. So this is a royalty free uh, track, which is about 30 seconds long. So you just drag it in there, and then it's got the whole song. And there you have it. So the whole song is automatically put in, but you have to set the bars to automatic. And so it's all, it's automatically set 15 bars. So let's put in another song. So click on that round icon again. Let's put Place in the Sun this time, Jules Holland's version, with James Morrison. It's brilliant. And that, that'll play. Well, that will play both together that role. And now let's see how many bars that has to come up with. So 107 bars that is. So that's the whole song. So it's quite simple. So to recap, click on Garage Band, click on Audio Recorder, click on that plus sign, Automatic Bars, click that over to Automatic, click on the Timeline Storyboard, click on that round thing there, click on music, click on playlists, click on purchase and click on your song and then just drag it into the timeline and there you have it. Simple.